Good day, YouTube. Welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. There is the Rhino here. There is Colgate here. And we are drinking a beer. This is, if you don't know, this is an ode to our good friend Lee Hoogley's Beer Reviews. This is a bathroom review. This is what we're drinking today. Bayside Brewing Company's Bronzeback. Bayside Brewing Company is in Erio, Ontario. Little tiny town, little tiny, tiny town. One road in and out. Uh, two roads in the town, big port town. This is the beer that they have there. This is the beer that's at every restaurant there. This is the beer that's all over the place and it's there for the people coming in on the beach. So Bronzeback is what, 5% alcohol? No, six, ooh, 6% 6 alcohol by volume. Here's what it looks like. It did have a big white, like off-white head. A little bit. When we poured it. I mean, it, in the glass, I mean, it does look okay. Mm -hmm. Smell. Sweet. Very sweet. Um, I I work in a bar. I've worked in restaurants. I've worked all over the place. And we always have the uh, uh, bags, the bibs. And so we have the uh, bag and box of pop. I've had those pop on me before. That's what this kind of smells like, is a pop bag and box. Just super sweet, pop concentrated. Extract. Yeah. Extract of pop, basically. Let's try it. The acoustics in here are great, by the yeah. way. Now I know why he does this. And I'm glad we're in a bathroom because in all honesty, this is horrible. Uh, for me, we, we were discussing this when we first tried it. Uh, somebody thought it tasted kind of like Coke. Somebody thought RC Cola. For me, this is Cot. Cot, for those of you that don't know, is the uh, no-name brand sold at, uh, sold at Giant Tiger. The um, GT Boutique. The GT Boutique. And it's just sweet. I mean, it does have an okay bitterness on the background, but that doesn't make up for everything else that it is. Uh, here we go. This is, the, this is the problem. If you're gonna brew beer, first off, I was told these are 320 a can. If you're gonna brew beer and you are a extract brewer, not a malt brewer, or even if you've turned into a malt brewer by now, 320 a can for this is highway robbery. Um, I would rather pay the dollar ninety-five for a Laker. I would enjoy it a lot more too. Uh, again, I'm not trying to bash you, but this this is this is horrible. I mean, it's great that you're now canned. It's great that you're now not just a growler bar, but the price wow. needs to match the product. It really does. Yeah, this should be. I know that you're in. You 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 have a corner on the market. You don't have any choice there. So I understand that. I can't fault you on what you're doing, but I can make a comment about it. This should be a budget beer. This should be your dollar ninety five can. Uh, if that. Well, you can't go much lower than that legally here. Is there any? I think dollar eighty five is. I think cheapest, that's isn't the cheapest. It? So dollar like eighty five. No, I don't. I don't like it either. In all honesty, I just put it up on, well, I tried to put it up on untapped. I gave it a 1. A 1 out of 10. We, so a 0.5. We tasted this before reviewing it, and then when I was told that we're reviewing it, I really tried to get out of reviewing it, because it's that good. Uh, you, you know, it's... <sighs> it's not the worst beer ever made. No. But, I mean, I can, you know what I'm pouring it. I can feel a headache coming on while we while we do this. It's just that sweet. Uh, I don't know if that's because of extract. I don't know if you're just under attenuated. I don't know what, what your problem is with it, but this shouldn't be released to the public. This, no. My first homebrew tasted better than this. Paul's so first mine. homebrew tasted better than this. Yeah. Well, yours wasn't much better. But it was. <laughs> but it was. It was still better. Uh, mine wasn't much better either, but... Give me one sec. I'll be right back. Sorry. I'll just uh -oh. Uh -oh. Ah! So, again, Bayside, you have a beautiful place, your food is amazing, your light beer is okay, your lager's okay. This, I don't understand this. I don't. Awesome. Yeah. Um, so, apparently, he has to get this out of his teeth. He Colgate. brought his toothbrush. Colgate here promoting the old uh, healthy gums, but this is that bad. I'm going to the bathroom, so. Thank you guys. One out of ten for me. What from you? Uh, point five. Alrighty. Out of ten. Bye guys. Thanks a lot.